Hi there, I'm Dr. Stephen Phelan and welcome to my video channel. Today I'm really excited to be doing a technology review. And this will be the first technology review that I will have done for my video channel. And what I'm going to talk about today is one of the most hyped pieces of technology that's come out in 2010, and that's the iPad. And you can see I have one of, an iPad right here. And I'm, I guess, what they would call an early adopter because I bought it on the first day. And fortunately, my dad lives in Rochester. He was coming up that day. It just happened to work out great. And I asked him to go stand in line at Best Buy and pick one up for me. And he was able to get there a couple hours before opening and, and uh, get in line. <laughs> and he picked it up. And, you know, it's a wonderful piece of equipment. It's nice and small. It's thin. And I just, I, when I saw the introduction, introductory keynote by Steve Jobs, I thought, for sure I can use this in my dental practice. It would be a really great tool. And I'm going to share with you now today one of the ways that I'm using it in my dental practice. And you'll see at the end of this video why I'm wearing my Team Canada gold medal jersey with Sidney Crosby on the back. You know, I ordered this uh, before the tournament began, and I had a very good feeling about Team Canada and, of course, Sidney Crosby. So you'll see the reason why I have this on my, uh, why I'm wearing this today when you see the end of the, uh, the demonstration of the iPad. So we're going to switch to a close-up view now so that you can actually see this really close and up close and in person and in action. So here's my iPad and essentially it's designed like a large iPod Touch or iPhone. You have similar uh, controls. So we have the large uh, home button here, we have the on-off button right here, and we have to slide it to unlock it. So it's very similar if you're used to using an iPhone or an iPod Touch. It's similar uh, feel and similar technology. And when I first picked this up, or when I first saw the video, I thought I can definitely use this in my practice because it has a keynote application. And if you've been to my seminars, you, you know that I've, I use a Mac computer to put all, everything together, and I use Keynote instead of PowerPoint. So this is very easy for me to adapt or adopt this to my practice because I have a tremendous number of Keynote little clips or presentations. And I use Keynote as well for not only seminars, but for patient communication and patient uh, consultations. So this just gives me a device that I can use right in the chair. So instead of having the patient look at a large computer, they can have it right in front of them. And it's nice and thin, as you can see here, the screen rotates really readily. And I can use this with Keynote to show patients different little presentations uh, about dentistry. So you can see I click on the T Keynote application here. And Keynote is, like, this, this machine is really fast. You know, compared to an iPhone, I have an iPhone, I have an iPod Touch. This is way quicker than either of those. It's quicker on the internet, um, it's quicker to load everything, and it's very responsive. So it's a very nice uh, device that way. And if you look here, this is a little presentation I made about guided implant surgery and we can just walk the patient through this. So I can tell the patients all about guided implant surgery right in the chair. My hygienist can pick up the iPad, bring it to their room. It's very elegant and easy to look at a uh, presentation that we can show them all about guided implant surgery and tell them about it right while they're sitting there in the chair and talk about the benefits. We can go back uh, this way. Yep, that's the backwards button. It's very nice, and here's the here are the menus. And I can go back to my presentations. I use it also, these are just some things that I used it for this week. This is a patient that we were doing a smile design appointment for. I was going to do an equilibration and talk about smile design for her veneer case. So you can look here, this patient has a tremendous amount of erosion. We had planned on doing some laser gingival adjustments. And sorry, there's some reflection here, so you don't really get a feel for how good the quality of the image is. The image is incredible. The quality of the image is great. But you can see here the patient has tremendous erosion, so we're planning on doing veneers. There was enough enamel I determined to do veneers, but I'm going to do very minimally invasive preparations because we're doing additive veneers. We want to add to the patient's um, existing uh, tooth structure. And if you look here, we can scroll through this. I can um, basically pick uh, photos and adjust these photos. 
just walk the patient through some different smiles that I've done recently and let them see, let this patient see some ideas that I have for her. You can see we can adjust the pictures really easily here. It's all touch screen controlled. I can move my photos around. So I happen to just actually put this photo of her smile next to another patient's smile right when I was doing the consult. I said, let's look at these together, see if you like the smile design, the incisal edge position of this compared to your present condition. And um, it's just very easy to use especially if you're used to Keynote. If you're not, they still give you, a, they give you an introduction, introductory Keynote to walk you through how to use this. Um, yeah, and all touch screen controlled, really nice. Here's the introductory Keynote right here. Uh, we can also look in iPhoto at photos, but I find that the Keynote's a little easier because we walk through the photos and we can organize everything easier than in iPhoto. Although iPhoto is perfectly acceptable. I've shown another patient a couple of photos in iPhoto. Uh, there are a lot of applications that are tremendous for the iPad, and that's the strength of a device like this, is all the different applications you can uh, get for this, uh, this instrument. You look here, this is Autodesk Sketchbook Pro. I actually used this to sketch a picture, and this picture is just for a full mouth case that I was doing. I wanted to show the lab that I needed a little more room in the envelope of function with the final wax up. So I sketched this out and sent it to them because it's very hard to take a sagittal picture through the teeth. And I, I thought that this would be helpful. So I just sketched this out in 10 minutes, and then I can email it to the lab. And I'll do a, I'll do a, um, I'm planning to do a number of little videos to show you some of the apps that I think are good for dentistry. You know, I have this uh, little little dental book, this LexiComp app, which is really good for dentistry. Check Dent's great for dentistry. Um, you can get on YouTube so I can look at my own little videos. And then I have a tremendous number of apps for my kids. My kids love this thing. Uh, my kids both have iPod Touches. They're three and five. They will be three and five, and they, they love their iPod Touches. But uh, this is really good as well. They like this better, but I don't think I'm going to give them this yet. <laughs> uh, they have a Marvel Comics application, which is great. I really like this little uh, Marvel comic application. Uh, you can look at your comic books right on the iPad. Let me show you uh, something that I bought in iTunes. The video resolution on this device is, is, is just beautiful. So here's iTunes. I purchased some videos so that I would have, so that I would have, um, you know, a number of videos to watch whenever I wanted to use my iPad. So here we'll go into my purchases. And this is what I bought for $2.99, the Canada-US gold medal game. And if you look here, this allows you to scrub through the, through the game, through the video, really at high speed. I can go to different parts. And here we can go to the, to the really the best part. <laughs> Let me just go back a little bit. And there it is. How fabulous is that? I have this on my iPad. It's one of the best moments in Canadian sport history. I have it on my iPad. I can watch it on the plane, watch it anytime I want. And uh, it's just a wonderful device. So there is that. You know, there's so many neat things about this. And it's very good for organizing yourself, organizing your to-do lists, your calendar. I find it better than a phone to use the calendar app. It's just nicer for me. And typing on it, as I said, is, is I found really easy. So I'm going to do some more technology reviews with this in the future, but I wanted to show you at least the keynote application first and the fun application of being able to buy uh, videos from the iTunes store like the Canada-US gold medal game. So thank you for joining in. We'll talk to you in the future.